Want to make a really easy side salad that's completely refreshing? Well, today I'm going to share with you how to make a simple tomato cucumber salad. It's the perfect thing to make ahead for a work from home lunch or for a potluck or a party. It's a really easy appetizer that you can serve with almost any main dish. You really can't go wrong with it. So anyways, I'm gonna take you into the kitchen and I'm gonna show you how easy it is to use cucumbers and tomatoes to make one of the best salads you've ever had. Let's do it. Do you wanna make restaurant style meals at home? Make sure to subscribe to the Sip by Go channel on YouTube for all my easy recipes. And visit sipbyco.com to get printable recipe directions. This super simple cucumber salad marinated in vinegar begins with dicing tomatoes in large chunks. I go ahead and I leave the seeds in there and I just cut out the stem and then they're ready to pop in the salad. If you have a toddler, then you probably would refer to this recipe like I do as a cuke and tomato salad. So this tomato and cuke salad also has three medium sized cucumbers and my favorite way to prepare the cucumbers is to slice off the skins, but don't slice out all of the skin of the cucumber. I like to leave a little bit in there so it has some deep green flavor, which looks really beautiful in the recipe. But I do wash them ahead so that they're ready to go right into the salad after this step. And then after slicing, the cucumbers are sliced in half or you can slice them in large discs like I'm doing here. Now I was making a really big chunky salad so I like them in these large pieces. And then the last main ingredient that goes into this tomato and cucumber salad recipe is some fresh basil leaves. So I take about 10 fresh basil leaves from my kitchen herb garden, but you could buy store-bought basil leaves as well for this cucumber and tomato salad and just throw them into the bowl in large diced chunks. And then it's time to make the dressing that officially turns this into a tomato cucumber salad marinated in vinegar. So in goes a half tablespoon of olive oil and a half tablespoon of champagne vinegar. I really love the flavor of champagne vinegar. It's a really light flavor that tastes good in so many different salad recipes that you can make ahead. And then to add some extra flavor to the salad, in goes some red pepper flakes that are crushed in salt and pepper and paprika. It's all whisked and whisked and whisked some more and then I encourage you to take a little spoon and give it a taste. I use my finger, don't tell anyone. And just make sure that it tastes exactly how you like it. Thank you so much for Cola Vita vinegar. They sent me their Cola Vita champagne vinegar. They make a bunch of olive oils too and in this recipe I used it and it was delicious. So I added just a splash more of the Cola Vita vinegar and then it was just perfect for me. But I like a little bit more heavy vinegar and if you do the original recipe, it'll work out just fine. So whisk that together till it's fully combined and then it's time to add the cucumber and tomato salad ingredients to the bowl with the dressing and give them a toss so they're all combined and they marinate in the fridge for about an hour to an hour and a half. Well, this recipe is basically over at this point. You just add the main salad ingredients of the cucumber and tomato salad. So you have the diced cucumbers, the chunks of tomatoes, the basil that's fresh, and you can add some salt and pepper to your own liking. And then you combine those ingredients together and you add in the tasty dressing that you just made and tried. And all that gets just combined together in a large bowl and you can stick it in the fridge so the salad marinates in the champagne vinegar. So it takes about an hour, hour and a half, but you could leave it overnight and it'll taste really good the next day. If you're looking for some other variations of this recipe, you could add in some Parmesan cheese or some balls of mozzarella. I also have a cucumber caprese salad recipe that you can check out at sipbitego.com. Doesn't this salad look so good? It has all the taste of summer, but these ingredients are available at the grocery store year round. And this is a really super salad that you could make ahead for an event. You could make ahead just to have a work from home lunch at, that's gonna actually taste good that you want to get away from your desk to eat. Um, this is really convenient if you're having a busy day to bring back to your desk. So just take the whole bowl and eat it. <laughs> as long as no one else in your house, no one else in your house plan on eating it as well. Don't forget to subscribe to the Sip by Go channel on YouTube for more delicious restaurant style meals you can make at home. Well, I hope that you're thoroughly inspired to make your own tomato cucumber salad at home. It's a great way to use up tomatoes and a great recipe to use up cucumbers that are overflowing. 
And don't forget to subscribe to the Sit By Go channel on YouTube for more delicious and easy meals. Now you can print all the step-by-step -step directions for this recipe at sitbytego.com. Well, until next time, I hope you have a wonderful and delicious day. Cheers! I love serving simple, refreshing side dishes with main courses like grilled chicken or pizza or anything else that needs some vegetables added to the meal to call it complete. And this recipe for a simple avocado ranch salad is one of my go-tos right now. Check out sipbytego.com to get the recipe and you can also find the video for this on the Sip Bite Go YouTube channel. Well, until next time, I hope you have a wonderful and delicious day. Cheers!